This is Fox News First. It's time to talk Hollywood gossip. We do it every Friday at this time. And once again, we're visiting with our friend Casey Carver, fellow Texan, as we just found out this morning. And Casey, we're starting with uh, Paris Jackson. And, and when I saw this earlier in the week, it really was alarming to me. Kind of a close call for her, wasn't it? It's very, very sad, yes. So she had actually, um, we were told that she's been having a rough year and struggling, and this is not the first time that she's attempted something. Obviously, this is the first time it's gone this far. She called the suicide um, hotline and told them that, you know, she was having problems, and they're the ones that actually called 911 and had the cops come out there. Cops believe that it was a suicide attempt. They believe that she was not trying to uh, necessarily kill herself, but just, you know, trying to get some, I mean, some attention or some help somewhere, you know, something along those lines. She did take a bunch of Motrin and also cut herself with a meat cleaver. Mm. And it's all over TMZ right now. It's uh, one of your top stories there. And so, as you might imagine, it's complicated because family members are trying. Everybody's coming out of the woodwork, it, se it seems, with something to say or, or I guess trying to help out. Exactly. And the school said, you know, we've talked to a source close to the school, said that, you know, they knew she was having a lot of family drama this year. As you remember earlier, um, last year, she, uh, the family had the whole standoff where there was a big ploy and play for money, and they took Katherine Jackson, the grandmother, away. And Paris, actually, there was a video of her standing up to um, Janet and a couple other of the family members. So that kind of kicked off her year, and then it just went through. And they say the downward spiral really happened when she was asked to be in a movie and someone in the family said no and they could tell a difference in her when they did sit, tell her no she was not allowed to do it they said she just kind of stopped caring and really her grades started to drop mm. that's unfortunate okay. well how about the beebs you know we're right in the middle of finals playoffs all that good stuff and apparently he's stealing headlines in miami Yes, he is. I think he pulls headlines anywhere he goes. Yeah. There's always something going on. And he's had three different separate altercations with paparazzi this week. Uh, one, um, his bodyguards actually uh, allegedly choked a paparazzi for taking pictures, stole his camera, pulled the memory card out. We also have, for another incident that happened, uh, audio on our website right now of him saying, telling his bodyguards to grab the camera from this guy. He uses profanity in this, tells him to grab it. The, guy's, the guy is actually pleading not to take his camera. Justin says, well, we'll just take your memory card. So that happened. And also at game seven in the finals, he had an altercation with someone that tried to take a cell phone photo. So he has just been you know, in the news for different altercations with photographers lately. I mean, has he released a song in the last few months? Because I don't recall talking about his music anytime recently. You know, he was on tour not too long ago because that's when he had the issues with the the but there was pot found on his bus. Right. So he has been doing performing and you know overseas and things like that. But recently, he seems like he's just kind of been bouncing around and been here in Los Angeles causing issues, mm -hmm. uh, driving fast. He's obviously in Miami, um, you know, and he's causing issues there as well. Showing up at Game Seven, uh, dressed very ridiculous in a leather button-down yeah. shirt and a four hundred dollar <laughs> Miami Heat hat. <laughs> yeah, and I know you guys have those pictures as well as long as he stays away from the spurs we'll be okay but casey thank you very much for your knowledge once thank again you. and we'll continue to watch you guys online thank and on you TV. guys exactly go spurs, go there spurs. You go. yeah thank you casey yes we were talking before the uh, segment here casey's a texas girl and is rooting for the spurs so we appreciate that all right you can check out tmz by the way on our sister station cw35 weeknights and of course the ipad app uh, all over the internet uh, tmz.com that's right and i believe